welcome here to more Talk FCB and today guys I want to talk with you about Fabrizio Diaz. This right here is a 20 year old defensive midfielder currently playing his football in Montevideo in his native Uruguay and this is a player that Barca have been scouting and tracking for quite some time now and very recently they met his agent in Barcelona to discuss a potential deal ahead of the summer. Now there's plenty of interest right now in Fabrizio Diaz but it's said that he wants to join Barca. Barca is where he wants to go and he is ignoring all other offers until we reach that resolution. Now the transfer fee for this highly rated young man is said to be around the 6 to 8 million euro mark, which I think in terms of modern football, for a player that is very highly rated, up and coming player in the game, that looks really cheap. That looks like a really good, potentially huge upside there for Barca because I think he's a really exciting player there. He's only 5 foot 9 tall, but he has got that Uruguayan tenacity about him. He's got that ability to be aggressive when needed. He's energetic in midfield, but the key with him is he also has technical quality, especially when you're thinking about a Barcelona midfielder, somebody who wants to sit a bit deeper in the field. You need to have that technical quality, and he has a really, really good blend, I feel. He's got a good head on young shoulders at a very young age in that position, and he also already looks like a leader in a team. But the only thing right now for Barca is, the only thing that's stopping it from being 100% completed is FFP in La Liga. Those words that we've heard so many times. Now, Barca are still waiting for La Liga's response to their summer plans and until we're 100% sure of the room that we have to play with this summer in terms of transfers we cannot fully close this deal but it is very, very far advanced. And I'm just interested to know, guys, what your thoughts right now are. If you have seen Fabrizio Diaz in action, what do you make of him as a defensive midfielder? What do you think that he could bring to this Barca team? And what do you envision his role being if we can sign him looking ahead to next season? So let me know all of those thoughts down below. It's an exciting link, and it's certainly one to keep an eye on. And I will see you guys soon for all of the latest news, of course. Thank you indeed for watching here today, for all of your support. But until next time, as always, Vishka, El Barca. Oh.